my final thoughts i mean i just i'm i'm really not excited to get spoiled to see what cell's design is gonna be that's pretty much like that's 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 my problem right now because it's gonna be everywhere yup like there's no hiding there really isn't i don't you know i didn't even i i'm pretty sure i said this where like on twitter at least you can filter words yeah and you know but honestly there's no point because you can't filter images i don't think you can do that and if you can well i just don't know right but other than that i've just come to the terms i've come to accept that there is literally nothing i can do yeah. <laughs> to fucking avoid this shit yeah so so i mean and and, and i mean if, if i had to pick i would say sure to this one because if it was the other way around for like broly for example i'd be so mad furious because that was the the one movie which thankfully there wasn't a whole lot that they could really have spoiled for us because let's face it like everybody knew what to expect like oh it's a broly movie oh he's fighting goku and vegeta and that's exactly what happened you know what i'm saying and then you know the whole fusion thing yeah sure like that was a nice surprise no the fuck it wasn't they freaking they 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 you know how they spoiled it they had fusion reborn in the motherfucking theaters months prior that's Yo, how don't I even it. don't even use the word fusion in front of me right now i'm so mad perfect segue <laughs> Be because let me tell you and honestly no. i waited days literal days to talk to you two about this specifically and kai i just want to be the first person to say i am so sorry i am so sorry because and you know what i'm about to say you already know what i'm about to say look at my brother's face <laughs> look at his fucking face dude i am so sorry for those that don't know for those who are not on the full power wavelength right now let me just spill the beans okay there's a i think it was tv commercial five one of the more recent ones it doesn't matter right it doesn't matter which one because what matters is something that we feared and it looks like it's happening and there's good evidence to support what we don't want to happen and let's give you the rundown really quick oh, what we don't want to happen what we yes so here 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 hear me out brandon <laughs> So, at first, the timeline goes like this. We were wondering, if this movie, End of Z, right? There's the first thing. And it pretty much is. Okay, are the immortal children going to stay immortal? No? All right, there's a ding, right? That's a good thing, right? They're, they're, they're aged, finally. Something we weren't expecting was the blue hair curveball right we were not fucking expecting that that is just something that they just it, it's just almost like toriyama just loves to fuck people right neither here nor there so like okay another random bullshit we're just gonna have to hold right i'm trying to be practical and i'm trying to be like yo what if trunks just dyed his hair you know what i'm saying what if and then i gave kai a one percent sliver of hope I said, dude, imagine if he fused, they, they, they fuse into Gotenks and he still has the purple, right? Even though we also admitted that if we did see Gotenks with blue, that would look fire. Okay, like, let, 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 let me admit, that shit would look fire. Even people, when they, when they did the freaking the fan art, that John was OD. It that, looked that OD. That shit was OD. It, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Seeing it like that, I was like, mm, maybe yeah right. <clears throat> right so so then we fast forward a little bit more after this whole like you know hair fucking debacle and there is a leaked image that came out advertising i think like a folder some like little piece of merchandise right 
and it was a picture of Piccolo, and it was a Gotenks. But the Gotenks, not only did he have that purple hair that we was talking about, we we're like, oh, right? A slight sl sign of hope, right? Gotenks was fat. Fat tanks. Fat tanks, right? And that's like a, that is when the first bit of worry emerged. Bit? Okay, a lot of worry, okay? Like we- oh, I... Yeah, yeah. It was, it was something that I was very feel, fearful for. And what was I scared about? I was scared that, oh my God, we're getting go tanks for the first time as an adult since G- Well, it didn't happen in GT. That's the thing. We got cucked twice. Fuck you, Goku. I will never forget that shit, okay? But the fear is if we get for the first time adult Gotenks, it's not Super Dragon Ball Heroes, and he stays in this fat form. That that's really fucked up. And now with this recent trailer, there's a little snippet with battle fatigued fat tanks which would imply that he might not, we might not actually see him in the natural chiseled, normalized Gotenks. Nah, I don't think we will. I, I don't know, bro. You I know, do. They, they do this shit all the time. Bro. But it's different now. Nah, this is different. It's this way, was it's definitely way different. different. This man's clothes were tattered and by the end of it, they were already split. Mm. Yep. See, the only <laughs> listen. Okay, and, and this is us. This is me trying to salvage <laughs> what could be. I really, I swear to God, I hope it is. Tr this is a trailer trickery. That T Tizzle. Okay, I really hope it is because the only saving grace that we that we have to see natural go tanks is if they cut back and forth between areas so like it's 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 un we're, we're under the presumption that this big final fight is literally going to be gohan the the kids and piccolo fighting cell max which we'll talk about cell max too obviously right and maybe pan pan apparently is involved as well whether that's going to be like a father-daughter thing with the Kamehameha, like, you know, a nod at that. Because, hey, let me tell you something. They've been doing so many callbacks for all these Gohan shots. Like, it's li it's literally like, that's the one thing that I they better not show. Because I'm sure it's going to happen. They've been, they've been literally doing all these callbacks. Like, like shot for shot, it's Gohan from, from the Cell Saga. Like, shot for shot, right? Dude, the saving grace is only if during this fight they will go they they will go back and forth to seeing Broly, Vegeta, and Goku and their fight and their training. Like, I don't know if that would even make sense. Because at that point in the movie, we're like almost at the climax, you know what I'm saying? Like we're at the end. What's the point? You know what I'm saying? Like, unless they're trying to like, I don't know, like match it. Like with with like a like some sort of like climactic like like they match the climactic finishes or like the moments I don't know I don't think it's gonna happen because this movie is way too Gohan and Piccolo centric you know like the only reason and let's face it the only reason why we're even seeing Goku Vegeta and Broly are because they're way too popular to not have in a fucking film you know that shit is obvious but. There needs to be some sort of like separation moment to justify even a 30 minute time skip within the fight for them to like, or they get fucking hit so bad. They get knocked out of it and then they do it again. That's the saving grace because yo, if they go a whole film, even though I know it's Gohan and Piccolo. But they go a whole film and they're gonna do a go adult go tanks for the first time and they're not gonna be this adult version. 
that we've all been dreaming of since we were young, bro. That is going to be a humongous disappointment. I mean, I feel like the, the trailer is kind of trolling. Even like, I, that's how I'm going to say it. I just feel like it's like a troll to kind of just get those conversations coming up type of shit. But it, I mean, you are right. It would be like. A big flop on their part if they don't give us that <laughs> natural go tanks. That's nope. how I see it. I don't think they're trolling. I th I don't think the trailer's trolling. I think the movie's trolling. I think the whole fucking movie is trolling. <laughs> That's the problem here. And you know what else is the fucking problem? Is what made me realize that there is zero chance for real adult go tanks in this movie is when I was watching Uchi's reaction to and like breakdown of that trailer. And he said something that just, it just resonated so hard with me. I just got so upset immediately. He said, I bet they're going to, or he said something like, I bet you they're saving adult go tanks for when the anime comes back. I was like, get the fuck out of here. I was like, you better not save nothing. <laughs> Yelling I was, at me like, through my you, video. <laughs> you said, yeah, I really was though. I was so sick. Because you said that and I was like, yo, that, that sounds like some bullshit that they would totally do. Yeah, I mean... It sounded too logical, so you said that, and I was like, man, it's over. Yeah. Because you're right. I... I I hate it, you know? Like... Yeah. I hate, I hate having enough of a logical sense for this type of stuff to just formulate these, like, conclusions. Or the, you know, just speculation, really, because... You know, all, all companies got patterns. And at the end of the day, it's like the way they're thinking about it is like, okay, like how could we really maximize an audience and profits and all that that comes with it? You know what I'm saying? You know, because, you know, obviously right now, the, the obvious focus is this is Gohan and Piccolo, right? They're, they're, they're going to get this time and shine and all this, right? Dude. And that's, and that's great. You know, this is something that loads of fans have been waiting to see happen, but the idea of featuring another character, not to say that this is going to be focused on them, because clearly it's not, but they are having some sort of involvement. And then for them to literally do said thing that a lot of people have been anticipating, waiting for and they do and the first time is a flub that's fucked i bet but, you they would argue that it's not the first time because they gave us gogeta right and i was just about to say that even with gogeta the first time we saw him was fat but it's different because when they advertised him did we see fat gogeta no that shit was literally an a, a comedy insertion and we knew that they were like it was something that we could calmly laugh at and enjoy the humor because we knew that's not what the fucking final product was about to be they thankfully and this is why i said what i said before with the whole like scene changing is because guess what was happening for that hour broly was fucking frieza <laughs> up son <laughs> like man's was literally getting tossed hulk style and they had the time to like wait around or do whatever. And I also, and I'm pretty sure I said this in the same video that you're referencing. I was like, they don't have a technique that we know of yet to just defuse. But I'm right. sure that could be something that gets right. introduced. <clears throat> nah, the, the way the way Dragon Ball treats defusion is just gonna be like they literally just got hit so hard they just literally got smashed out of it. That's how that's how Dragon Ball defuses. Right. And yo, I wouldn't be mad. Like, listen, if if they look look respectfully, if they fuck up the fusion, that's fine. You know what I'm saying? Because Go Ten and Trunks, we don't know what the hell they've been doing for this whole time skip, whatever, right? And they're out of practice. It happens. It's not like they're doing fusion every fucking day to get the fucking fingers to line up perfectly. And you they're know, not used to their newfound heights. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 they're not used to the newfound heights, right? And, and hey, just like their dads, they didn't nail it on the first try either. So it's just like kind of like a, a trope at this point, you know? It's like, dude, the only 
The only fusion that doesn't fuck up on the first try is Patara. Like, really. That's it. Because you can't... How do you... How do you fuck that up? You know what I'm saying? Just you have the earring... in between them. Like... <laughs> <laughs> I always thought about that. Like, what if you just, like, threw some shit there? You know what I mean? Like, yo, they would probably, nah, they would probably just die because, like, <laughs> they would just fuck up the whole formula. <laughs> but, yo. you know, like, that is that is the only thing that I will ever give Vegito or, and Kefla, I guess, too, because they're the only two people that we've seen, well, outside of the gods, right? But, like, the only two, like, Saiyan pairings that we've seen use the Patara. As soon as that, that shit is guaranteed. You ain't got to worry about it, right? It's like the easiest way to do it. But I mean, yeah, like if they, if, if, if they fuck up the first time, okay. But then the, the next thing I'm going to be looking out for is I hope Cell knocks their shit. Like, like, like not even bro, three minutes bro. into their fight. He's going to max them. He maxes them, whatever. Freaking, he maxes the shit out the, that these kids, and he 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 knocks them so hard. Trunks hair, hair turns back to fucking purple. Okay, like that shit would be hilarious, just and I'd be just, like, oh, just let him fuse into Veku's son, that fat fat tanks, and then as soon as he as soon as he literally rolls up, Cell just tail whips him like, get your Krispy Kreme looking ass out of here, just boom, defuse. <laughs> Yeah, someone in the comments uh, said they should name him Trunton, which actually it makes me that, think. That they, is one of them. Did they have a name for the fat go tanks? I don't remember. It, it was it was one of those. I don't think they ever like made it official or anything like that. But I know that Trunkton was one of the like pseudo fusion names. Yeah. Right. Okay. <sighs> yeah, man. That is one of the saw, things. You saw that they were literally like, like you said, like this. This movie's full of callbacks, right? And you saw that they literally did that with uh, Veku and Fat Tanks, with like his clothes being ripped, like his pants being ripped, like he got shot in the <laughs> ass or something. I actually didn't see those. No, I didn't see yeah, those. Yeah, they they literally like if you look at whatever whatever happened to Veku in the Fusion Reborn, I'll bet you they're gonna frame by frame frame by frame it and do it with do it with the Fat Tanks. Yeah, man, this shit is crazy. <clears throat> Things we have to worry about for this movie, which, you know, what? I, go, go ahead, go ahead. No, I was going to say was like, we did not have this problem with Broly. That's all I'm saying. We did That's not have this problem that, with that movie. That was a real film. This is, this is a meme. Those are real fucking trailers too. Right. This is this is a fucking joke. Not this bullet. Not this four or five part series of yeah. trailers. Dog this ain't shit. it. <laughs> Dog. <laughs> this ain't what? it. I was gonna say. You know what else? I'm I'm not hype about. And I know I know you're not hype about it either. <laughs> mm, mm. Lay it down. We're gonna have to graze over this topic rather quick, cause this this isn't some shit that we linger on. But this bitch really wished for the fatty. You know, I'm glad you brought that up because I, just, I, I was going to bring it up too. I, I saw that and I was like, I know. I, oh, that's that good shit. <laughs>